this is Show Mystery again, welcoming you back to uh, the Bang Bang's kitchen in Twinkle Thomas Food TV. Uh, to all of you and to all of yours, uh, all the merriness and the good cheer of the Yuletide season. Uh, if you're seeing this after Christmas, belated Merry Christmas, if you're seeing it before May Santa bring uh, lots and lots of good cheer and uh, goodies for you. Um, a very happy new year to come to all of you. Um, in, in, in the Bang Bang's kitchen, we have always tried to bring uh, flavor not just in terms of food, but in terms of what we are bringing to you. And uh, this new segment of ours where uh, we are bringing in uh, guests into the uh, Bang Bang's kitchen whereby we are, it's, it's uh, gone from being show mystery in Bong Mom's Kitchen to show mystery's Otiti's in Bong Mom's Kitchen. Um, we uh, have got a new guest this time coming on, coming on, a guest who is not yet a mom, but uh, will soon be, I'm sure, in, in the years to come. And uh, we'll uh, bring in an, her own uh, distinctive flavor in terms of cooking and uh, uh, we will not waste much time uh, and usher in the good cheer that uh, my new guest will bring in with her and so i don't uh, make any more uh, uh, of your time and i uh, welcome our guest today uh, the not yet mom into the bong bong's kitchen shambhuti uh, or uh, we all also call her roshnai welcome roshnai so without much ado, let's call him Shambhuti Singha or Roshnai. Welcome Roshnai. Hello. Hello. So this is Roshnai, uh, a budding psychologist and a counsellor and a teacher. And a teacher, yes. Okay. So Shambhuti or Roshnai is uh, a qualified psychologist. She is also a qualified counsellor for counselor. rehabilitation counselling. Yes. So you've got a license to practice as a rehabilitation I have a license counselor. to practice, yes. So you, anybody needs a shrink? I'm You there. know. Okay. So she'll shrink you. Okay. Uh, so beyond the shrink, she's also a teacher um, at um, an institute for um, handicapped uh, individuals uh, and their rehabilitation right yes. and uh, she's also a part-time foodie or full-time foodie i'm a full-time foodie oh she's a full-time foodie and a part-time cook uh yeah a part-time not a full-time cook not a full-time cook not a full-time full oh so what are you going to cook for us today i'll be making something different okay um, we we all love chinese food but uh, so we'll be making something uh, like a fried rice where we're going to substitute the rice with uh, cauliflower and we're going to call it uh, prawn uh, cauliflower fried rice. So, a fried rice without the rice? Without the rice, yes. Uh, zero cap, KL. Zero calories, zero carbs. Figure. Hmm? To maintain the figure. To maintain the figure. To maintain the figure, yes. maintain the fitness. Yes, okay. Yes. So, and to save time as well. Oh, to save time as well. So, ladies and gentlemen, if you are wanting to find out the secret towards how she keeps fit, that's substituting rice with cauliflower. Oh my God! So, uh, so this is this is this is uh, this is what this is cauliflower. This is cauliflower. Uh, we've taken small pieces of cauliflower. So you look at the, the cauliflower floor. Yeah, yeah. Okay, into the size. And how it comes just, from here to here? And you just put them in the grinder and that's it. Oh. Okay. Two seconds. Two seconds. Okay. So uh, you take the cauliflower, break the florets into smaller bits, put it into a grinder for about two, two seconds. Two seconds. Two spins. Three spins. And this is what you get, right? So we will be making uh, uh, a rice without rice using this. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So healthy option. So ladies and gentlemen, let's not make much ado about it and get cooking. Shall I light it up for you? Please do. Okay. So here goes. It's such a pleasure always to light it up. Huh? We'll start with uh, frying prawns first. 
So with that we'll be needing some white oil. We're okay. using rice bran oil here. Again, health conscious, so she's using rice bran oil. Yeah, I think I need to drizzle a little bit more to be so health conscious. So much so. So these are your prawns? These are prawns. This is a shrimp. Yes. So uh, the shrimp is adding the garlic. So the shrimp is uh, again healthy, deshaled, deveined, yep. clean. You got it from the fresh market or are you using something which is a frozen variety? Got it from the fresh market. Oh my god. Abong and her love for the fresh fish market. So this is what? This is uh, garlic paste. This is garlic paste, okay. And some Okay. And we'll be adding the garlic. Just sizzle, 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 For you people who are talking about health, so we have got, we have got zero carbs. Not zero carbs. Um, I heard that um, one cauliflower is about you know um, 12 uh, calories and uh, 29 calories of fat. So not much in terms of carbohydrates. And uh, the fish, being seafood, you got a lot of omega fatty acids which are your good uh, fatty acids and uh, rice bran oil so again high on your fupa or polyunsaturated fatty acids so that's another aspect of making it healthy food you want to fry it to just pick up the little bit red yeah you want to fry it you want to fry it till it becomes a little bit red Golden brown. Golden brown. Golden brown. Not red. Golden brown. Which shrinks you have to be very careful with your body. Because that would mean another session on the couch. Right? Another session. On the couch? On the couch. What do you know about shrinks and couches? Why can't you do it on a chair? Start off with uh, soil. The great fry. The great fry. Okay. And we would, uh, his, his uh, counseling sessions would be on a couch. You would put the people to sleep? Uh, no, no, no. no. He, he would just let them sit on a couch, relax on a couch, and not just on any other sofa, a comfortable couch. And he would sit behind them and we would speak to them. Rather, he would let uh, the clients speak. And dig his own grave. Speak and dig your own grave. And what about Yon? He follows Soy to an extent. He is talking to father of psychology. He is talking to father of psychology, yes. Rather for counseling, yes, he's the father of counseling. He's the father of counseling. So who's the father of psychology? We call it Freud only. So, so Freud is. So Freud is the figure in psychology. psychology. So you, you, you keep them aside from me? Yeah, I keep them aside. She's using just onion and carrots. If you onion. want, you can add a little bit of beans, beans and capsicum. Beans and capsicum, yeah. Okay. The green pepper? No, I've been asking green pepper before. Chop green chilies. This is about, I think, two or three green chilies. Two, two green chilies. Yeah, how much? A medium sized uh, onion. Okay. So, this will be good for how many people? Uh, good enough for two people. Two people. Two people. So a little bit more oil. She's using the same pan, the same oil that she fried the prawns in, so it will give a little bit of the aroma and uh, you know the burnt garlic and the, um, the the prawn fried prawn. 
again take it to a light golden fry. Yes. Okay. Not, not a we will fry. add some salt. Okay. Salt. Base. Uh, yeah, base. A pinch. So we you got it a golden fried now. The yeah. carrots have also softened up. Yes. So what's the next step? Uh, we just add in more oil and add the cauliflower rice. Rice. The rice without the rice. So we are now mixing up the um, fried onion fried and onion. the tea. Or fried onion. Or fried rice. rice. The rice without the rice. It's only a shrimp who can come up with ideas like rice without the rice. No? Is there anything already a concept in this? I don't know. Don't think so. There isn't. There isn't. Oh, thank heavens. Thank heavens. We don't have to worry about what our dreams will come through about this rice or the rice without the rice or the rice with the rice. So now we are more or less coming to what a traditional fried rice looks like. So we just add some flavors. Okay. Some flavors. So what do you have here? We have uh, red chili sauce here. Okay. Are we adding the prawns now? We add the prawns now. Okay. So mix up the prawns evenly. I think we are almost ready, aren't we? We are almost ready. We just add a little bit of soy sauce. Okay. As a reduction. Balance the flavors. Add a little bit of pungent smell to it. I think we are almost good. Uh, we'll add some this is this is looking more like sticky rice, thigh sticky rice. Um, I think we will need a little bit of oil in this, just a drizzle. Some more salt. Why don't you do the oil? Into uh, and, and into smaller pieces and put it into a grater for two three spins, and we made a rice out of that. The rice without the rice. We took some uh, uh, garlic and ginger in the oil. We added the prawns. We fried the prawns, set it aside. Then some chopped onions and some chopped carrots. We uh, fried fried that off. Dash of spoon. Uh, dash of uh, Salt. salt and then uh, we added up uh, the rice without the rice into it fried it up mix it up and then we added the uh, some sauce the, and the, 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 the prawns. prawns and then we added some sauce, sauce. for the flavors we used you used red chili sauce and, and I used uh, sauce. Uh, sauce. red chili sauce is a basic uh, taste that she added up to make it a little bit spicy and hot and, and then to reduce this, uh, the taste, as a reductor she used uh, the, the soy sauce sauce. and give the typical pungent smell of Chinese food. So you're ready now? Yeah. Can I taste? Sure. So, mm. the smell is just the right uh, pungent uh, kick that you get with uh, Chinese and the flavors of the red chili sauce has made it a little bit hot. Uh, in it. If you like it a little bit tangy, maybe we could add a little bit of vinegar on it. Yeah. And the prawns are just the right uh, crunchiness and yet uh, it being seafood is got the juicy flavor that, that the prawn gives. And if you didn't tell me, I wouldn't know that this is not rice. So. Rice without rice. 
if you want such incredible uh, food, subscribe, like and come back for the next round of uh, cooking. Till we meet again, uh, happy eating, happy uh, holidays and thank you Shanti, thank you, thank you Roshne for this incredibly low carb and uh, tasty food right from the shrink. Thank you so much.